Welcome back guys to our slide 2 walkthrough and today I'm going to finish up the rest of Paris which, which is Dimitri's level and this is going to be Operation Thunderbeak and I'm going to switch to Bentley and I'm going to go down here now and I'm going to sleep dart this enemy and blow him up just because he's in the way and I hope you enjoyed this cutscene coming up so I see you guys later come on chum let's get to that water tower well, I guess that really wasn't a cutscene, but you know what I mean. So right now I'm going to go over here with Murray, and this is going to be a mission. Well, not a mission. This The whole thing that we're doing today in Paris with Dimitri is going to be um, the operation. So I'm going to kill these guys, and then I'm going to jump into Murray's arms, and he'll throw me up there so I can bomb the entrance. And then I can get in there later on. So just throw me up there, Murray, and then we'll get started. And there we go. I'm going to bomb it now. And let me get thrown back up there by Murray. Whoops. I tried again. There we go. So now let's go in. And I'm basically right now, I'm going to have to turn these pipes just to get the water flowing through. So we could like overflow the fountain and shut it off. So I'm just testing out to see which pipes are going to overflow it to make the fountain turn off. And then once the fountain's turned off, then the maintenance guy will come out. And then we'll have to pickpocket him and get the key from Sly. And then once that, once that will happen, we'll have to trade it to Bentley so they could get into the truck and knock down this uh, giant thing in the front of the nightclub. So I'm just testing these things right now, and I almost got it all flowing. I just need to see where um, the last one is jammed up, and I think it's right here. And yes, it is. It's off, all right. They're already sending out the repair guy to fix it up. They pocket the keys to his repair truck without being seen. <clears throat> Okay, now I'm going to go down here and pick a pocket the maintenance guy. But first I'm going to take out his guards cuz I don't want I don't want to get killed. Oh, and I got hit but it doesn't matter. Let's get up here now just to avoid the guards. Stay up here for a while until the guard comes up and we'll kill him. And I think he's up here already, so I'm going to kill him right now and then I'm going to go pick pocket the maintenance guy. All right, let's go over here and let's pickpocket him right now. Let's circle. And there we go. We got the repair key truck okay. or the I repair truck the key. I mean, it sounded really retarded. It's all you. Let's head out for the repair truck. Okay, so now we're going to head over there with Murray to the truck and hopefully not die. But the enemies in this level, which is Dimitri's one, is really easy. In Rajan's level, I think they're like rhinos or something. They're really hard because they throw knives at you. But anyways, here's the truck part. Now they're going to make the trade with the keys. And now we're going to have to find a way up to the top of that peacock so we could actually, um, Bentley and Murray will shoot like a thing up there so we could get down. And they'll then winch it up so that it could get pulled down into the fountain so I could get to Dimitri's boss battle. So I'm just going to make my way over here by using the circle button. Now I'm going to climb up this metal pole. And it'll take us to the top and we'll enter another cutscene. Okay, now they're going to probably drive over there and I'm going to shoot the winch up there with Murray. So let me try this now. And let's get it. Oh, yes, we got it on the first try. So now I'm going to come down here, and there should be enemies that are going to take out the truck, but we're going to get them first. Alright, so let's just keep whacking Sly and don't stop. Because I don't want this truck to die or explode or whatever. And just picked up some health, so, uh,. 
Like whenever I get hit now, I think there is health around this area. And the chairs and different objects around you. I keep getting hit. Got that guy, and I got three guys as well. And I also picked up health, so I'm back at fully health. Just keep defending it. And luckily I have no homework today, so I'm allowed to upload this video really early. Behold the majesty of gravity and inertia. That was real subtle, Bentley. Okay, you jump in, grab the clockwork tail feathers, and we're out of here. Okay, now we're gonna go and fight Dimitri, which is the boss battle, and I'll see you after the cutscene, guys. bumming my house up and bringing me down. So very uncool. Why can't you let birds and bees be free, bro? Listen, Dimitri. You have no idea what you're playing with. It'll bring more than your house down. Look, bro. I see you are a tough cowboy. A man with taste, style, vision, a connoisseur of finer things. Like me. Look, I'm sure that two cats in a bag like us can work something out. Huh? We smooth. Look. The money. You like the money. You can take all you want. I can. No deal. You and the rest of the claw gang have to be stopped. Clockwork will never again see the light of day. Just hand over the tail feathers and we can. What is this with clocks, bro? Have you no vision? Are you hearing what I beam to you? Do you think you have juice? Don't show me a little mind when talking about such big things. Do you think you can swing the bat? Show your bling and let me shine you. I have no idea what you're saying. And your suit sucks. Oh, let's dance! Oh. Okay, here we go. Let's fight him now. Hopefully we can get it on the first try instead of dying. And it's really easy. Once that yellow explosion happens when he runs out of the purple stuff, then you could go and attack him, and you pretty much can defeat him only in, uh, like, two pauses. Like, when um, Dimitri runs out of that purple stuff, you could just go attack him, and then you'll probably finish it. Because this boss battle is really easy. It's not really long, either. I think I only get hit because I'm really close to the green tube right over there. So let's hit him now. He's almost halfway, uh, lost halfway of his life. Almost got him. Whoa, that was a glitch. He just pushed me all the way over here. And that was the thing I was talking about with the glitch, how I got hit. Whoops, got tail spun. Okay. Gonna hit him more. Just picked up more health, so probably could defeat him now. Keep getting him sly. Hope we can do it. And there we go. Here's the cutscene. You take clockwork feathers and my counterfeit in operation. It's past tense. I'm doing you a favor. What kind of thief prints money? There's no honor in that. You... <laughs> cracker box! <sighs> Alright, here you go guys. Hope you enjoy this video and I'll see you next time. My gang and I have done it. The clockwork tail feathers were ours, and Dimitri's counterfeiting operation was ruined. Due to the untimely arrival of Carmelita, my escape got a little tricky. Angry at having just missed me, she took it out on Dimitri. Shutting down the nightclub and throwing the frustrated forger behind bars.
the gang and I headed out of town for a week in Monaco. Bentley wanted to try out his new card counting formula, and I figured the team had earned themselves a well-deserved break. <laughs> 